Hi, my name's Liam and I'm part of the technical team at Cutwell. One of the most common questions we get asked is how do we work out speeds and feeds properly? So hopefully by the end of this short video, you'll have a better idea how to do this more successfully. First of all, we need to work out the RPM. The equation is 1000 times VC divide by pi times D. The VC is the surface speed and this will be given by the tool or the insert manufacturer and will change depending on the material you are machining. The D represents the diameter of the milling cutter or the drill but if you're on a lathe this could be the diameter of your billet or your bore. So now we've calculated the RPM, all we have to do is work out the feed rate. Now this will depend just on whether you're milling or if you're turning. If you're turning, this is going to be given in millimetres per revolution. But if you're milling, this will be given in millimetres per minute. So let's do an example together. This example is based on using a 40mm diameter RM4 face mill with 4 teeth. We will be cutting 316 stainless steel using a PC5300 grade of carbide. With all recommended cutting conditions, we recommend going middle of the road. This gives you a chance to adjust your speeds and feeds accordingly. So for this example, we will start middle of the road with a surface speed. Let's say 210 meters per minute. Let's put this into our equation. 1000 times 210 divide by pi times 40 which is the diameter of the cutter. This should work out to around 1670 RPM. Brilliant, so we're all singing off the same hymn sheet. All we need to do now is calculate the feed rate. As a starting point We'll go with 0.15 millimetres per tooth. So, 1670, which is our RPM, times by 0.15, times by 4, which is the number of teeth on the cutter. This should work out to 1000 millimetres per minute, and this is your feed rate. So, there we have it, speeds and feeds made easy. But if you're still unsure, please do not hesitate to contact our technical team today. Thank you for watching.